want to thank Craig McKay and Joanne Nelson for coming and for the inspiring song and the inspiring words from Peter Talikoff. We're honored that our neighbors from Mishapakot and First Nations accepted our invitation and we hope to continue a strong working relationship with those neighbors. I would like to now ask each member of council to give a brief greeting to you, beginning with Mr. Shiasso, Councillor Shiasso. How does that sound? <laughs> Pull your mic over. <laughs> Thank you very much for the uh, ceremony. It was very beautiful. And Peter, thank you for the prayer. Councillor Besner. Um, <clears throat> I was purging some files the other day and uh, I came across a, uh, a saying by George Burns and I thought it might be appropriate for tonight seeing as uh, we have all these addresses to make. Uh, so uh, George went on to say that um, the secret of a good speech is, is to have a good beginning and a good ending and to have the two as close together as possible. <laughs> <laughs> so that's my way of saying it because I, I hope I will be brief. First, I want to thank um, the citizens of Wawa for their support and encouragement right from the onset of when uh, I announced my decision to run for council to present. Uh, it has been more than ever expected. I hope it is a good omen and uh, I want it to be uh, it's truly appreciated. In return, I promise to, to work hard for the common good of all and to be committed to the tasks, tasks at hand, of which I can say uh, that I know nothing, but uh, I'm ready to get involved. Uh, the councillors um, and the mayor said we had the opportunity a couple weeks ago to tour some of the facilities. Um, and for me, this was the first time of opportunity to meet some of the superintendents and, and heads <coughs> of the departments and uh, that was very rewarding. Uh, plus uh, visited from places that I'd never seen before. I want to thank our department heads and administrative staff. Uh, you really truly impressed me so far. Um, it will be a pleasure to work with you and I hope to get to know you more as well. In this encounter I feel our town has good leaders and key roles and we're truly blessed to have you. And in closing, uh, as I look to my colleagues on council, I strongly believe we have a wonderful team here. I look forward to working with all of you, and I wish us all a very good turn in office. Well, I would uh, like to also um, thank everybody for their overwhelming support during the election. I was uh, blown away by the the amount of support and all the good wishes and um, I guess I uh, you know I, I had uh, certain expectations when I ran uh, when I was running for council and um, uh, I feel strongly that I will um, not disappoint the taxpayers in this community and the, the uh, the community as a whole and I do feel very comfortable <coughs> with the group that's been elected and I think that we're going to be a very positive um, working group and working team and and I know the town is well run all the staff are do a marvelous job and that was demonstrated in our our tour also I really I didn't I guess I underestimated the infrastructure of our community and Thank you very much. Again, I want to <coughs> certainly thank um, the community for their support. Uh, I look forward to, to working with uh, the new councillors and, and the mayor. Uh, we have uh, a lot of the same problems out there. We have new problem solvers and, and uh, I know we'll work very hard uh, to solve a lot of the problems our community faces. I think in the last few weeks uh, a lot of walls have come down and we have a lot of material to build bridges. Bridges uh, that will bring us success, bring us new partnerships. I think as uh, the new councillors um, start working with staff and as we work together, uh, we will develop a vision for where we want to take Wawa in the next four years. 
and our job as as counselors is to is to do a lot of listening, to do a lot of reading. Uh, we will discuss things together. But in the end, you ask yourself what, one question: What is best for the municipality, of Wawa? And then you make your decision based on, on that answer that you'll find. You'll find it in your heart. You'll find it uh, through that vision that we will develop, and uh, the job will become easier as we go along. As we keep that that vision in mind, we work towards that. Uh, I think we will have a very successful four years, and I'm certainly looking forward to, to working with these folks uh, for the, the overall good of our, our community. Thank you. This evening represents an historical moment with the swearing in of Wawa's first woman as mayor. I am proud and honored to be that person. Wawa is not alone in this, with several women mayors elected in Northern Ontario, some also for the first time. I read some time ago that by this decade, women over the age of 55 would compose the largest demographic group in North America. We would also be the wealthiest group of women in our history and made so by our own work. We have an opportunity to contribute and to effect positive change in our community. It is time to turn our talents and experience to doing so. This will be my goal as mayor over the next four years. Wawa is a resilient community. We have had our ups and downs. The latest downturn has been a long one. We must govern keeping in mind the difficulties facing our citizens and businesses. At the same time, we must be prepared. New opportunities will present themselves. We must recognize them and act to ensure that we receive the greatest benefits possible for our town. We have a majority of new members on our council. I am confident that as we face the challenges ahead of us, each and every one will base their decisions on doing the right thing for the well-being of the community. I look forward to working with them. Together we will strive to be accountable and transparent. We will look for more ways to inform you of our policies, decisions, and actions. At the same time, we ask you to be in touch with us. If you have a complaint or a question, call one of us. If you have suggestions, we definitely want to hear from you. With the commitment of the new council, the dedication of our skilled staff, the support of our neighbors and your participation, we can work towards changes that will benefit us all. Let's get on with the task. <laughs>